Hello everybody and welcome back to another video and today we are back in the spaceship world. We have not been here in a while, I believe over a year. As you saw in the opening time lapse we did that bottom part and today we're probably going to be doing some of this. Oh this is, oh this is big. Oh, I haven't been here in a while. I haven't made the other side of this yet. So, yeah. Um, I do have a, uh, a design in mind for this ship, this ship obvi obviously. Um, I don't think you guys have seen this yet. I tried putting in several videos in the past, and I kept having issues um, with making it. But this is going to be probably a storage area, and this is like an airlock or a boarding tube. Um, I'll show you the other side here. right here um please tell me what you think of this uh, i'm not sure how well it looks but yeah um give me a second here and we'll get to working on this video i'm writing down some coordinates here 227 13 4 7 and let's go over here oh right here 13 3 oh there we go we got the floor here done. just trying to figure out exactly what I need to do here is this what I yeah, I'm going to put in the rest of these little slats, and I'll get back to you when we actually have a floor in this room, finally. And there we go, guys. I have now accomplished in five minutes what previously took me a time lapse. So, eh, pretty good. So now we need to figure out exactly where this outer wall is going. It looks like I ended it there. I'm going to assume I knew what I was doing. <laughs> and the wall needs to, and I'm going to assume that the wall needs to come out to that far. Um, let's see. I think this is far enough and it's going to have to be too thick. So we're going to fill from basically from right below this block all the way up to here so I will do that and I'll be right back amazing and now that that surprisingly easy job <laughs> is complete I think it's very important that we run these lines across and I think that that is best done in a time lapse. So, enjoy guys.
Aha! We finally got all of that done. I mean, we still have to do... Oh, I'm trying to figure out how this works. Uh, we still have to do the turrets all across that side, down below. Oh, wait, hold on. No, we don't have any turrets on this side because the main body of the ship's going to be over here. So I just need to do the turrets down on the bottom of that side and finish up this room. I will probably do both of those off camera. I really quick want to show you guys something I saw during the time lapse out here. Look at this. Now, I don't know if you guys have ever seen these, but I remember these because way back in the day, before they added pistons into pocket edition, so way back when, oh, that was, that had to be two or three years ago, I had a thing called block launcher. I think it's still widely used. It crashed on me recently when I tried to get it, so I, I don't have it. But it would allow you to do mods for pocket edition, and one of them was a piston mod. And every time I log on the normal Pocket Edition instead of Block Launcher, so I would log on in vanilla, every time I went to the area with pistons, I would see these. And they'd tell you to update. And I thought they were like cocoa beans or something. I, I don't know if I ever knew that they were telling me to update. I don't know why they're here. I don't use mods in this world. Well, oh, even the bedrock. That's really strange. That means these entire chunks are corrupted. Uh, my guess is, basically... The tablet I'm currently recording on, let me just move this around real quick, make sure I'm still recording, alright. The tablet I am currently recording on is not the tablet I started this series on. That was the tablet I use for the time lapse, that little Steve guy going around flying building. And the reason I, I do that, uh, the reason I'm not recording on it anymore is this tablet has better video quality. It's HD instead of normal D. I guess. So, instead of um, instead of recording on lower quality, I record on higher quality. Well, when I got this new tablet, I had to move the worlds over, so I moved them through the files. And I'm guessing this world got very slightly corrupted. Luckily, we had nothing built over there. I am curious. So we'll do this. And next time we log on, we'll see if this gets corrupted with them. Hmm. Very interesting. Uh, but anyway, guys, I think I'm going to call it here today. I don't know exactly how long this video will be. It probably will be under 20 minutes. Um, and I'm sorry about that, but I do want to get this video up. This is the second day of recording. I don't like to record um, for more than a day. So sorry about that. But next episode, which hopefully will be coming soon, not a year from now, we will work on all of this and hopefully get this room complete. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching, um, and I'll see you all next time. Bye.